be seeing more rain in through tonight and again tomorrow as well. Cloudy skies will be sticking around and we have some drizzle in places, some rain in others. This is what it looks like in Akron right now. Ominous skies there off in the distance, but we'll have light rain throughout the area kind of off and on throughout the rest of tonight. Temperatures staying in the 50s for much of this evening. So our weather headlines, we're going to be staying cool going into our Sunday with more rain ahead into next week. Temperatures will warm up close to 80 degrees and we'll have more storms into our afternoons and evenings. Once again, more of that pattern we're used to. This is a little we're mixing things up a little bit here for the area, keeping things on the cool side and the scattered rain showers through much of the day. 60 degrees are high so far today. 52 are low and 95 94. The record set back in 2006. 79 is our average afternoon high. 59 degrees, the current downtown temperature, 60 at the airport, which is our high for the day, and our winds out of the north at 7 miles an hour. So our current temperatures mostly in the 60s here for the Front Range and the Eastern Plains, 50s and 60s for the higher elevations. If you're out toward Grand Junction, 70s for you, and also 50s toward Telluride. So we've had scattered showers for much of the day. We're still left with some light rain here in parts of eastern Colorado. Not much happening here in Denver, but Earlier today, we saw great coverage of rainfall here all across the I-25 corridor, and then we've seen it slowly fall apart. We still have some leftover rain here to our south and east near Lyman and also just west of Salida. In this area, we're going to be seeing some rain still tapering off here in the next couple of hours. As for our lows by tomorrow morning, mostly 40s and 50s. We'll have 30s and 40s off to the west and 30s toward Pagosa Springs and Alamosa. Our temperatures mostly in the 40s and 50s early tomorrow morning. We'll have 30s up toward Red Feather Lakes and Estes Park. And as for our hourly planner on Sunday, yes, it includes more rain here in Denver and for the metro area. Now, the good news is our severe weather risk is very low. It's going to be kind of that soaking uh, scenario where we get the rain just kind of falling throughout the day. Our highs only in the 60s again for the afternoon, well below average for this time of year, which would be in the upper 70s. Temperatures in the 40s and 50s off to the west. We'll have 60s towards Steamboat, 70 near Eagle and mid 80s out toward Grand Junction into the southwestern Colorado temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. So we'll have another wave of rain coming in from the, the east, pushing up toward the divide in the high country. And we'll have rain here at one o'clock in the afternoon, so it's mostly a morning of rainfall starting to taper off as we get toward the later evening, but another wave of rain coming in late night, and that will last us into the early morning hours of Monday. Our super seven day forecast showers again tomorrow, temperatures in the 60s, but we warm it up into this next week. We'll have 73 on Monday, scattered afternoon thunderstorms, temperatures in the 70s through Wednesday, right around 80 on Thursday, and more storms to round out the week.